life is love to me. My granddaddy built this house. With his hands, he stacked wood, hammered nails, and shaped resilience into these four walls. Home. My grandmama breathed life into each crevice, hand stitched every cloth, darkened her knees for every vegetable devoured at the table, and still left room for patience. Home. Is where memories yellow the ivory keys and the forgotten tunes still find their way into your mindless honey. Home. Where the smooth stride granddaddy was known for now hiccup for the cane you must use. But the letters are still here from great aunts and first cousins and grandnieces in Virginia and North Carolina and way up north in Illinois, stacked neatly or fanned intricately across the deck where grandmama will read aloud the latest happening in the family tree, while the radio plays the Roberta Martin singers, as granddaddy drifts to sleep and night officially dawns. Can love be quantified when its inevitability mimics the air in the room, forever life's necessity? Living is but a practice in remembering and capturing memories for stories told in tomorrow's tomorrow. Life is love here, so practice, remember, and pass down your story. Hi, I'm Camille Jones. I am a Cincinnati native, and I'm a writer, dancer, and senior manager of advancement for Elements Hip Hop Cultural Arts Center based in Cincinnati. I chose this piece because I felt like it called me first. Um, once I stepped into the space, I immediately felt a sense of home. Obviously, the, the framing of it is essentially um, a room, a, a home, and it's designed to uh, evoke those feelings of nostalgia. Um, and I immediately thought of my grandmother's home, the home that I grew up in, um, and spending time with my grandmother, my cousins, um, so I immediately felt like this was the, the space that I needed to write about, uh, especially since my grandmother recently passed away. Um, so it almost felt like I was able to pay homage to my grandmother by writing a piece um, about this particular uh, project within the overall experience. So yeah, I, so I wrote a piece about this, this space. <laughs>